flame of hope flickers as the wind howls down from the mountain. To make this journey, you'll need companions. Let's meet them at the crossroads. Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Loki Oren, and this video is part of a series of videos where I am looking at all of the hero paths for each character in Darkest Dungeon 2. Today, we're looking at the Man-at-Arms. Stand fast behind me! So Bulwark is one of the less clear hero paths. It explicitly calls out something called shield attack skills, which get a 50% damage buff and 10% stun resistance piercing. Yet there are no skills in the game that are labeled shield attack. Well, the good news is that the folks over at the Darkest Dungeon 2 wiki have puzzled this out. They mean Rampart and Hold the Line. So Bulwark buffs Rampart and Hold the Line substantially, basically bringing their damage totals in line to an upgraded crush. So they're hitting fairly hard because the Man-at-Arms in general hits somewhat hard given his tanky identity. In addition to those benefits, Stand Fast, which was already an okay tanking skill, gets two taunt tokens as well, which really substantially improves that skill, as that is a very natural synergy for the man-at-arms to uh, tank just even more damage. All of this does come at the cost of reduced damage for crush and repost, which really just means retribution. But minus 25% damage is not that noticeable, particularly if you've been playing with Sergeant, as Swinging three times around is still quite a bit of damage. So, nerfed, but not overly so. One thing to note with Bulwark is that because you'll be using Stand Fast more and you have some other options than the typical uh, Retribution spam that's kind of the Man-at-Arms bread and butter, there is a world where if you find yourself in the first rank, you could make use of the skill Courageous Abandon. Uh, the Bulwark does kind of open that door, though in my experience I would play around this a lot more optimistic or opportunistically rather than building around it as this is a difficult skill to make use of and given that it only hits first rank to first rank, there are probably other things you could be doing. That being said, big number does go burr. Finally, just want to call out that Bulwark does not impact Command or Bolster in any way. Both are excellent skills for the Man-at-Arms to be buffing allies and stress healing. So even if you're not as sure about the lack of, you know, or about a weaker repost, you still have a Man-at-Arms, which is a pretty awesome kit. 